Hey everyone, I'm actually going to start um, to do some Dragon Ball Z figure reviews out of the figures from my collection. I'm going to do what's, um, a range from Jax to Bandai to Erwin to even bootlegs. So yeah, today I am starting on some random Jax figures. Not any certain type, just Jax. Okay, so let's first let's start off with um, Gohan here. Team Gohan from the Bojack movie. Um, and you know, he... Uh, he's a, an okay figure. I mean, he looks good. You, you never f actually see a figure, a Gohan figure like this, except the one that Jax released um, in the orange key like this. But, um, um, I like him. He has a lot of good articulation here. You know, he moves at the elbow here. Um, the shoulder too, ball joint. Um, he moves his waist. Um, he moves his feet here. Um, his knees. And his head around. And, you know, I could put him in different poses because of this. Yeah. <laughs> um, the only thing I don't really like about Gohan here is his face. Something about his face isn't really, like look like Gohan. I don't know if it's just me, but that's what I don't like about him. You know, overall, it's good. I mean, he's a little bit, like, he's really tan, too. He's usually, like, lighter skinned. Um, lighter skin tone. But, you know, overall, he's good, and he's kind of, like, a hard find. So, if you want him in your collection, I recommend it. Uh, go to, I got him off eBay, loose, for, like, seven dollars so yeah maybe you can find him there next up is let's see let's see if i can get him here okay okay now okay it's uh jack some um, raditz it's i don't have the Irwin one so i can't compare but it's, it has a lot of differences uh he's more tanner here and his um tail is all looser, it's not like painted onto him, which is good, I like that. Um, his, um, let's see, his expression is totally different. I, I like the expression on the Irwin one better, on his face, but his hair is really nice. I mean, the way it's sculpted, the way it looks, um, it's better than the Irwin one in that sense. And he is very articulated, um, moves at the elbow here, um, shoulder, um, his waist, his head a little bit, not too much, um, his knees, and his feet here, uh, but he, he's good, um, I think he's a little, his legs are a little bit too long, I could have made it a little bit shorter, I don't know if it's just me. Yeah, I like the way they did his armor, so he looks pretty good to me. I got him in Toys R Us, but maybe you can find him off eBay. I'm not sure if they still sell him at Toys R Us. So, next up is First Form of Frieza. I like this one a lot. He is one of the, he is like the best First Form of Frieza I've seen. There's another one released. It's, uh, let me bring it out, um, let's see. It's originally by, uh, Bandai, but it was re-released by Erwin. Uh, he's an energy blasting one. You can take off his armor here on this one, but, you know, you, it's not nearly as good as the Jax one, because he has so much articulation, he might not be able to shoot something, but, um, the way they sculpt it and the way he moves, it's, like, so much better. Uh, but, here's a comparison. His tail is all the way to the floor on this one, and this one, just, like, up here. But I guess it all depends on the pose and everything. But he has a sinister look on his face here. I like the way he looks, and he has a more purplish skin, and, um, again, the articulation is pretty much the same as the last two figures, you know, 
and I recommend this figure a lot. He is a good find, is especially good in your collection. And if you want all the Frieza forms, I suggest you get this one. But I mean, you can also add him in. He's not too bad, but um, it's just for completing collections. So yeah. Um, next up here, I w I'm going to bring out is uh, Dr. Mew and uh, see this and uh, Baby here. So I really like these two. They come in a two pack. Um, Dr. Mew especially like his rip um, clothes. It's like he's like battle damage, you know. Um, I think it was after Baby uh, came out of his uh, little pod looking thingy, the little um, test, the little tube thing he was getting stored in. Um, he, they come with a, a lot more other things in the two pack. I just don't happen to have them. Okay, so I really like how they made Baby's body all like metallic -y and stuff. He has a great expression, very true to the anime. And um, I especially really like um, Dr. Mew here, like like he got really beat up. Um, he has his eye glass, his eye glass like broken off here, and just everything is ripped around. You know, these are the only figures you can actually find of these two. There's different forms of baby out there, but this is the only one like this. And same same type of articulation um, had the waist the knees the feet um, even this even the little baby has that articulation <laughs> so I recommend these figures hard to find though if you can if you come across them on eBay or something I suggest you buy them because they're great in your collection and just great finds. Got them at the toy store at Toys R Us too, so uh, they probably don't have them now. So my suggest is go on eBay for these. So yeah, that was my first review, and there will be a lot more to come. Like I said before, from the race to Bandai, to Irwin, to Jax, to even bootlegs, and even AB. So yeah, until next review.